popping boys today's topic is going to be can semen retention help you during no contact bro what effects how can it help you blah 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 i'm about to get y'all all of that and get y'all my opinion on it in one second man just hit that like comment subscribe button first bro and let's get straight to it see here's the thing about semen retention it's a double-edged sword and here's why on the one hand, the effects of semen retention are great, bro. You experience more energy, more motivation, more drive to push to do the things that you want to do. You are less likely to be in a hungry state when you are in semen retention because you know that you are in semen retention. And all of these things are great things when it comes to getting that woman back, when it comes to being in the state that you need to be in for that woman to see that you on your grind and for that woman to like essentially come back to you for the law of attraction to work in your favor so yes from that standpoint bro i'm not even gonna lie to y'all semen retention is awesome plus the energy benefits and all of the other benefits that it gives you however there is a flip side to this bro there is a double-edged sword to semen retention because it does put you in a hungry state in the sense that bro let's just be honest when you don't tap nothing when you ain't you when you don't tap nothing you're hungry and so that energy shows itself and so the minute that woman come back to you the minute that woman reach out to you bro you're gonna be in that hungry state like that in that way right so you got all of this good stuff going on on this side but on the other side of semen retention you have things that are pushing you toward that woman because you ain't had nothing else since but because you ain't been seeing other women and here's the thing i don't think in semen retention it's a good idea to date other women because it's just too easy to relapse it's just too easy to let yourself go bro and let's just be honest there's not a lot of women out here who about to handle you hesitating for any reason let alone you hesitating and she probably don't know why because likely you're not gonna tell her you in semen retention and if you do she gonna wonder why what you doing what's happening that's weird all types of stuff like that so if you want to go through the explanation of that by all means i recommend semen retention here's the thing semen retention has its time right I genuinely believe that every single man should do it at least once in their lives, bro. I don't think semen retention is a permanent thing. However, I think that it's a thing that is desperately needed in a man's life to teach him discipline. And see, discipline is one of the greatest things as a man you can learn because discipline helps you with women, helps you with business, helps you with finance, helps you with life in general, bro. And the kind of discipline that semen retention creates is unmatched because you are literally going against every natural biological urge in your body, bro to have a better outcome as a man, to feel better as a man, to get further in your life and grind harder as a man. You are disciplining yourself to go against every urge you have felt since puberty, my boy. So it is a place for it. Now, do I think you should be one of these dudes? I'm on day 100,000 of semen retention. I've turned into the overlord God. No, bro, I don't, I don't, that's not a thing. Like, let's be honest about it. What is a thing is you you get higher T, bro. You get more energy. You become more focused. You remove distractions. You become way more disciplined in the things that you do. And you can go further, faster when you won't see me retention. But I think there is a time that it should end when it is becoming toxic and dangerous, bro. And I think, you know, I'm not going to put a time frame on it because every dude has a different time frame in which he has to do what he has to do. However, during no contact, if you are partaking in semen retention, I would do semen retention for the beginning, maybe. The beginning of no contact. After a couple months, I would stop. I would start to date other women because... At the end of the day, you have to get to the place where you have an abundance mindset. And in this case, semen retention works directly against having a, 
an abundance mindset because you have to see other women. You have to sleep with other women. You got to you got to make sure you're understanding what it is that you want out of a woman so you can require that from this woman when and if she come back so you can put her in a place that she needs to be in because let's just be honest you in this place to begin with because you made a mistake as a man being in semen retention is good for getting your thoughts straight and getting your discipline right to not hit her up in the first place or whatever you need discipline for in your life because let's just be honest you're here because you didn't have discipline whether that be emotional discipline a uh, 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 phone discipline you texting a three billion times or whatever kind of discipline you did not have my boy so when it comes to semen retention during no contact I am a fan, but only for a certain amount of time. Now, see, that time is up to you as a man, and, and it's something that you should be well aware of. Do not let it get to the point where it's hindering you, becoming toxic, becoming this thing that's holding you back or stopping you and making you hesitate. And the minute you get to that point where it's like, oh, I'm hesitating because I don't want to break semen retention. I'm hesitating or I'm not seeing other women and I'm in this hungry mind state, even though, you know what I mean? I'm trying to do this thing. I think you should never let it get to that point, bro. Now, should you not be watching the P stuff? No, you should never be watching that. I would take that out of my, my repertoire, my category, whatever you want to call it. I would take that out of my life immediately and just remove that. But semen retention is only good for what is good for. Plus, you don't want to be sensitive when it is finally time to get back to that P. You don't want to be sensitive, my boy. Trust me. But you do want to gift the gab. Click that video right there, man. Like, comment, subscribe. It's your boy, Kaden Rake. I'm out of here.